What's up mga Kap? It's me, Kap Joey of Kap Unity Canada. Welcome to our free webinar. Before we start with Kap, I will just introduce ourselves and what are the services that we provide. And also I'm going to share on this webinar for Kap the 10 reasons why you should immigrate to Canada. So if you're ready, let's begin. So Kap Unity Canada Kap is a licensed immigration agency and a licensed recruiter here in Nova Scotia, British Columbia, Alberta, and recently, Pumakap, we just get our licensed recruiter in Saskatchewan, Pumakap. As I mentioned, Pumakap, Community Canada is a licensed immigration and licensed recruitment here in Nova Scotia. So our office, Pumakap, here um, in Canada, in Nova Scotia, Pumakap, the Army main, main office, of Community Canada is in 1083 Bedford Highway, Bedford, Nova Scotia. You can also verify our licensed recruiter Pumakap here in Nova Scotia by visiting the link that we have on the screen. And as I mentioned, Pumakap, Community Canada is a licensed recruiter in Alberta, Nova Scotia, British Columbia, and Saskatchewan. All the licensed Pumakap will not be possible without the effort and dedication of my partner, Miss Amelia Ajok, our licensed immigration consultant. Miss Amelia is the co founder of Cap Unity Canada. And also, Pumaka Pro Tip before you deal with someone that are planning to help you with your Canadian dream, make sure Pumaka that they are licensed immigration consultant. You can check their license, Pumaka, or verify their license at College of Immigration and Citizenship Consultants. So, you, the link is also on the video as well. And also, Pumakap Cap Joey is the managing director of Cap Unity Canada. Uh, I'm also the co founder of Miss Amelia here in Cap Unity Canada. And probably you're wondering why Cap? You already heard me saying Cap every time I have a video. Probably I send you a message and then there's a Cap um, before your name. So, what is Cap? Cap Pumakap in Tagalog means Kapate. It's a short term word of Kapate. In English, Pumakap, it's siblings. So instead of calling you bro or sis, I, we are gender sensitive, it's better to say cups. Whatever your gender preference, Pumakap, it's better to say cups. Diba? So you don't need to say bro or sis, but say cups. Cups also say in, in Tagalog, kapuso, kapamilya. Diba? Kap, cups, kapatid. So that's the meaning of cups. And also you're wondering what's the meaning of Cup Unity Canada. Community Pumakap is sounds like community because we are your community here in Canada. We already have a lot of success stories Pumakap all over Canada, not just in Nova Scotia. We also have an, a lot of applicants that are in temporary resident visa, like tourist visa, work permit, um, student visa. We have also permanent residency from Express Entry and Provincial Nomination Program. So we have a lot of success stories from all over Canada with our team and with my partner, Ms. Amelia Ajok, a licensed immigration consultant. We're confident Pumakap that we can help you achieve your Canadian dream. But the question now Pumakap is how to achieve the Canadian dream. We always believe Pumakap that if you want to immigrate to Canada, you need to have someone that can help you and guide you an expert an expert that can help and guide you to achieve your canadian dream and we are proud to maka for almost three years a three years in nova scotia and with my partner miss amelia ajak for almost 10 years as an immigration consultant to maka we are confident that we can help you with your canadian dream however Pumaka, we have our motto in, in, in Community Canada, together we reach your Canadian dream. It means, Pumaka, it not, it's not just Community Canada, but it's also about you. So you as an applicant, you need to make sure that you are fully aware of the process. You are also prepared. And at the same time, Pumaka, you understand that there is a process of immigrating here in Canada. It means, Pumakap, you need to provide some documents. Without the documents that we require, or the Nova Scotia, or the Canada requirements, if you're able to provide that, those requirements, 
then we cannot process any document. So it's a collaborative effort to mock up. You and as an applicant and our agency, we will work together to achieve your Canadian dream. But the question now is, why Canada? We or you can go to other province or, I mean, you can go to other countries like Saudi, Australia, UK, United Kingdom, or United States. You can go there, right? Why, why Canada? There's a lot of options, right? So whatever your reasons for makap, why you want to immigrate here in Canada, I'm going to share the 10 reasons why you should immigrate here in Canada to strengthen your purpose, to be inspired to makap, to do more, to, you know, to materialize the plan. Sabi nga, um, if, if it's only a plan, then it's just a dream, bro. Right? If you have a plan and a dream to makap, you need to implement it so that it will happen to makap. So anyway, to makap, what are the 10 reasons why you should immigrate to Canada? Number one, Pumakap, is the free education of your kids. I know you as a parent, probably you're starting family, probably you already have two or three or five kids, Pumakap. Immigrating to Canada is the best time, Pumakap, because you can enjoy the free education. Remember, Canada, Pumakap, they have one of the top, top uh, uh, school system, Pumakap, all over the world. So aside from getting the free education, you're able to enjoy the top quality education system around the, around the globe. And also Pumakap is the free healthcare. A lot of you Pumakap is also aware how expensive it is to get sick in the Philippines. So imagine Pumakap, if you don't have money in the Philippines, you cannot go to the private hospitals because you need to have a deposit to be admitted. Or if you go to a walk-in clinic, you need to do laboratory, you need to pay Pumakap before you get the result. So the bottom line, money talks in terms of health. But here in Canada, Pumakap, we, call, we have the universal healthcare wherein everyone can afford to go to the hospital for checkup, for laboratory, for diagnostic purposes because it's free here in Canada. It's a free healthcare here in Canada, Pumakap. So, you as a parent, Pumakap, your objective is to get this benefit, Pumakap, and how to get this by getting a permanent resident visa. So the bottom line, Pumakap, is if ever, knock on wood, you get sick or your kids sick, get sick, the best thing about Canada is a free healthcare, Pumakap. So we don't want to be sick, but if in case, we are just a human being, Pumakap, but at least in case, Pumakap, you don't need to worry your healthcare here in Canada because it's free. And speaking of worry, Pumakap, a lot of you, Pumakap, is also thinking the retirement plan. What is your retirement plan? Right now, Pumakap, I know you're young, probably you're between 20 to 30, Pumakap, so you're still young. So retirement is not in the option yet or not in the table yet. But I want to highlight, Pumakap, one day you will be in the retirement age. But the question now is, what will happen to you now? So if you are currently working in Dubai, Abu Dhabi, Singapore, Probably there is a very slim or zero chance, zero chance to, to get a permanent resident visa. I know some, some of my friends from in Singapore, they're able to get a permanent resident. But the point is, are you able to get a permanent resident and at the same time, enjoy the retirement age? Here in Canada, Pumakap, you'll be able to enjoy the retirement and at the same time, enjoy the benefit of the government because you can still get a retirement plan with the government of canada speaking of benefits so child benefits so if you have kids pumakap that is under uh, primary to high school pumakap they can get a at least 500 dollars per child per month but be mindful pumakap that it will depend on your family income the more family the the the, the greater the family income pumakap then the lower the child benefit. If you have like a minimum income, Pumaka, then probably you're able to get the full per child benefit, Pumaka. So again, Pumaka, another benefit of immigrating here in Canada is starting your business because some of you are OFW right now, currently working in Dubai, Abu Dhabi, Singapore, or Hong Kong, and your blueprint or plan, Pumaka, is what? To save money, to start business in the Philippines, and then save money was successful, you will stop working in abroad. That's the usual blueprint. 
how about pumakap? You immigrate here in Canada and you start your business in Canada pumakap. How, how about that? Because Canada pumakap is very supportive to people that want to start this business. So it's very minimal government regulation to start your business. It's so easy to start business here in Canada compared in the Philippines. And of course, Pumakap, you have the opportunity to land here as a permanent resident or after Pumakap, the permanent resident, you apply for Canadian citizen. So if you don't want Pumakap that 100% you'll be Canadian, you can also apply for dual citizenship. Another thing Pumakap is I already in, um, share with you the education system, the health system, the pension, the child benefit. One thing that I wasn't able to explain to you, Pumakap, is the unemployment insurance. Unemployment insurance, Pumakap, is when you lost your job and the, you, you have a government support, Pumakap, until you get your ne next job. So that's, <clears throat> that's a good thing with unemployment insurance. What I want you to do, Pumakap, is to analyze if this why, why Canada is the enough reasons to push through your Canadian dreams. I already presented to you the advantages of immigrating here in Canada. You know, Pumakap, that immigrating here in Canada, you can bring a brighter future for your kids because they are free from primary to high school. And we all know that Canada education system is one of the top education system around the globe. And also, Pumakap, as a family, and especially for your kids, you want them to secure Pumakap in terms of health. Knock on wood, you don't want to, to get sick. But if in case someone's sick from your family, you know Pumakap that you can afford to go to the hospital because it's free here in Canada. You want to secure the future of your family. One thing that I want to, to, to make sure Pumakap that once you are in Canada, you're secured with your retirement. Because there's a retirement plan here in Canada. Another thing, Pumakap, if you want to, to secure your future, you can start your own business. There's a lot of grants, uh, trainings, support from the government so that you can start your business. And this is something that I want to highlight, Pumakap. I want you to understand that there's a lot of advantages of immigrating here in Canada. There's a lot of reasons why you should immigrate here in Canada. And one thing that I forgot to mark up, that you can bring your spouse and your kids and start your, 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 you start your family here in Canada. Because you can bring your spouse, you can bring your kids, you can buy your home, you can buy a car, you can start your business. This is something that you can do here in Canada. But the question now, Pumaka, despite of the advantages that I mentioned to you, are you ready to provide all the documents needed because this is not an overnight process. There is an eligibility, there's a requirements that you need to comply. But the question now is, are you ready to comply with all the documents? And if it's yes, what I want you to do is to click the link right now and talk to our onboarding specialist. Our onboarding specialist, Pumakap, will help you and guide you, Pumakap, what to do next. Especially, Pumakap, if you're not immigration ready, you don't know what to do, you don't know where to start, I strongly suggest to get in touch with us and talk to our onboarding specialists. We have a lot of programs that we can present to you. As we mentioned, Pumakap, we are licensed recruiter in Alberta, Saskatchewan, British Columbia, and Nova Scotia. We have also a licensed immigration consultant, Miss Amelia Ajo, where we can guide you what to do next. So if you want to take action, and if you see yourself, Pumakap, that in three, four, five years, Pumakap, that you will be in Canada, click the link and talk to our onboarding specialist. That's the first step that I want you to do. Thank you very much, Pumakap. It's me, Cap Joey of Cap Unity Canada. Thank you very much, Umakap, and see you here in Canada.